How many lines of symmetry does a regular hexagon have? Now, the line of symmetry, the meaning of the line symmetry is the line that cuts a shape exactly in half. So, line of symmetry is a line, okay, cuts a shape in half. Okay? Now, here, let's see how many lines of symmetry does a regular hexagon have. So, let's draw a regular hexagon. Okay. This is a regular hexagon. So, a regular hexagon. Has six points here. So, now, how many lines of symmetry for a regular hexagon? So let's say this is A, B, C, D, E, F. Now let's take, if we take this line, cut the shape in, from this line. So it will be half. So this is one. We have two. We have three. We have four. We have five. We have six. So we have six line of symmetry. Does a regular hexagon go? Okay. Refer to the diagram below. We have this diagram. Line A is a line of symmetry. Line A is a line of symmetry. Lines of symmetry, which means that this line cut this shape exactly in half. So this half would be exactly the same like this half. So we have this angle is 124F, so D will also be 124. So angle A is 105, so angle C will be 105. Angle A, B, E is 41, so this angle also is 41. And E, F will be equal to D, C, and B, C will equal to S, B, and F, E will equal E, D, because as we said, this line, cut the shape into exactly two halves. Now, here the measure of angle ABC, we have measurement of angle ABC. ABC is 41, this 41 plus 41 will be equal to 82. So the answer here is 82. Which of the following shapes has one or more line of symmetry? Line of symmetry, line, cut, Shape cuts shape half exactly half. Okay, now let's see this shape. If we draw a line of symmetry here, so this half is exactly like the same half. This half, we did a line here, this half exactly the same like the other half. So, this is the right answer. Now let's draw, for this shape, we'll draw a line of symmetry like this one. We'll see that this shape, this half is not like this half because this one is not like, this line is not the same like this line. Okay, if we did another line of symmetry here, draw a line of symmetry here, we'll see this half is not the same like the other half, so this is not the right answer. Now for the arrow here, we'll draw a line of symmetry here. This half is exactly the same like this half. Okay. Here is saying one or more. So I think this is the only line of symmetry. So this is the right answer. Now let's see the shape. We'll draw a line of symmetry like this. We'll see that this line is not like this, the same line of the other half. Okay, let's draw here a line of symmetry. Also, this half is not like this half, so this is a wrong answer. On the grid below, shade two more squares so that the completed shape will have four lines of symmetry. Four lines of symmetry, okay. So we have here this shape. Okay, this, we see this empty square or unshaded square. Don't have the same the other side. If we draw, for example, a line of symmetry like this one. 
okay? So if we have this unshaded square, it has to be in the other side. It's not there, so let's draw. Let's shade this square. And this square is also unshaded, so let's do this also. So here now we will have this half will be equal to this half. And if we draw a line of symmetry like this one also, so this half will be equal to this half. We do a line of symmetry also. We'll see this half will be same like this half and the other side like this one. So this half will be equal to this half, this four lines of symmetry. So we shade it. The squares, these two squares we shaded, so we have the right answer now here. What is the degree of rotational symmetry of the shape below? Degree of rotational symmetry, the meaning of degree of rotational symmetry or order, it can be order of rotational symmetry of the shape, okay, is the number of times. It gives me number of times that it can be rotated around the shape, can be rotated around a full cycle, which is 360 degree. Full cycle is 360 degree. Great. So the number of times when I, every time I'm rotating this shape, a full cycle, so I need to know the number of times which I rotate it and still have the same shape. For example, here in this shape, for example. If I did, if I rotated this shape one turn, for example, this 90 degree, I rotated 90 degree, I rotated 90 degree. So this, when I rotate 90 degree clockwise, so this shape or this part of the shape, when it comes here, it will be like here, right? I will get the same shape. So this is one turn. Now here, I rotated another 90 degree, so this shape will come here, so the result, I will have the same shape, so this is number two. Now I rotate this also here, 90 degree, it will be here, and the final, I will get the same shape, so this is turning three. At last, I will rotate the shape again 90 degree. So now the turn, how many turn, how many degrees I rotated the shape? One, two, three, four, four multiply ninety, so three hundred sixty, which is means full cycle. So I will get the same shape also. So how many turns I did? I rotated this shape, and I get the same shape. One, two, three, four. So the answer here is four. Okay. Okay, we have referred to the figure below, fill in the blanks. The number of line of symmetry, line of symmetry, we said before, line cut, cuts the shape exactly in half. So let's see here. I have this line. If I start from this line here, the shape, the two halves are same. So this is one. Okay, we'll come go here. We'll do, this is second line, two. Okay, here, three line. Here, four line. Here, starting from here, opposite now, five line. From here, I cut, I'm getting two halves, six line. Here also, I'm getting two halves, seven line. Eight line. So I have here, it line. Now the degree of rotational symmetry, degree of rotational symmetry, as we mentioned before, number of times it can be rotated, the, the, the figure will be rotated full cycle, which is 360 degree, and it will have the same shape, or same look. Now, for example here, let's start with this point. I want to rotate this point And this is the shape. I have this shape and I have a point in this shape. So let's start rotating this point. 
So when I throw it at this point, 45 degree, if you can see it can be 45 degree and comes here, what I will get, I will get the same shape. Another 45, and this I will get the same shape. So this is turn one, turn two, or come here, turn three, go here, turn four, five, six, seven, and return back to the its original will be eight. So I have eight rotational symmetry. So here in this question, I have eight line of symmetry and eight rotational symmetry. Which of the following figure is drawn with a line of symmetry? Line of symmetry, line, cuts, shape, exactly, and exactly halves. Okay? Here, this is the line of symmetry. This half, same like this half, right answer. This is the line of symmetry. So this half equal to this half, right answer. Here he's saying this line of symmetry. No, this half is not equal to this half. And this line of symmetry, this half is not equal to this half. Refer to the figure below. How many lines of symmetry does the shaded figure above have? Okay, I have this is the figure. You see, this is the figure. Shaded figure. Okay. I don't know why he was in the coordinate spin, but no problem. So let's draw line symmetry. Line of symmetry, we said we'll draw a line, cuts a shape exactly to half. So we have this line. This is half, half are same. And we'll draw this line also. So this is half and half the same. So we will have two line of symmetry. What is the order of rotational symmetry? Order of rotational symmetry, number of times. It can be rotated, this shape can be rotated around the full cycle and still look the same. Okay, so let's rotate this pentagon full cycle and let's see how many times I will rotate this pentagon, I will have the same shape. So here, let's imagine there is a point here. So I will take this point to this one here. So if we take this one, I will get the same shape, right? We'll get the same shape. So this is turn one. Go the other side would be turn two, three, four, return back to five. So we'll have five turns. The Shape, if we rotate the shape, it will still look the same. So we have here five. Okay. What is the order of rational symmetry of an equilateral triangle? Let's have equilateral triangle. And all equilateral, all links are sides are equal. So I have a B, C, now I need a new order of rotational symmetry. As we said before, order of rotational symmetry the, is the number of times the shape can be rotated around a full cycle, which is 360 degree, and still look the same. So I have here a quadrilateral triangle. So when I move A, rotate A to B, I will get the same shape of the triangle because it's a quadrilateral triangle. So this is the turn one. So I move A will be here. So let's move again. Rotate A from A to go to C. This is another turn. So I will turn A back to its original place. So it will be turn number three. So I will have three order of rational symmetry. Okay. Refer to the figure below, fill in the blanks with the correct numbers. One dot is missing for the set of dots drawn to be symmetric about a dotted line. So I have this line is symmetric. Okay. So I have two points lie on this symmetric, so it will not be counted with me because they are in symmetric line. Now the, the coordinates of this dot are given. So there is a missing dot. So let's see this dot where it's uh, location. 
And this line of symmetry, line of symmetry, as I said before, that a line cuts any shape exactly to half. Okay. Now, for example, let's take this point. I have this point and this line of symmetry. So when I go move, make a length here, so it have to be exactly the same side because line of symmetry. So this is the point, right? Now I have this point. It goes the line of symmetry. So ah, this is the missing point. I have the point here. Must I have, must have the point here also? Same length and same distance from the line of symmetry. So I have this point. Then this point is two and zero. Okay. Okay. Let's see the other points. I have this point far from the line of symmetry. It have to reflect to the other. So I have this point. And in line of symmetry. Imagine you have a mirror. A mirror. Okay. So anything in the right side, the other half would be the same in the, the other half, okay? Now I have this point, so I go there, the same length, and this point, this point. So now the point is 2 and 0, okay?